Hi everyone, welcome back to episode 7 of the Kenshi Project Genesis playthrough. I don't have a name for this series yet. Uh, apparently I was supposed to name the series, and I have no idea what I should name it. So at the moment, I'm just going to call it the SOB playthrough as we found the SOB uh, nation, I guess. Uh, which is Sons of Banarchy, or Sisters of Banarchy, or Spaghetti Sauces of Banarchy, whatever works for you. That all applies. Um, I have some good news. Um, I was able to find out what was wrong and what worked at the end of the last video, episode six, we found this little house that I could build. And once I built it, I realized um, we can actually, I'm not sure if I can show this to you. Uh, someone should be in there. I guess not. Glitterbrat. She goes in. You can see how big this house actually is. I thought it was much smaller, but apparently, as you can see, it's kind of built into the cliff face, which I didn't know you could even do with Kenji. I thought it ended right about here. So I thought all this space wasn't there, and I thought it was a waste of time for $750. But uh, since the video, I built a, a research bench a little bit. I built a fire. I'm going to move some of this stuff around. I have enough space here to get a little bit of a start going. All I'm debating doing is put in like two little resource things for copper and iron. That way the people out in the field can return their own stuff, which will train their athletics as well as their strength. Um, maybe a cooking uh, barrel or a, a food barrel right there next to the fire. Maybe a, a stove, a couple lights, maybe a workbench to, or maybe an armor plate bench where you make armor plates and then turn that into weapons. I mean, that's about it. I'm not trying to uh, cheese ball the game. I mean, it's it's a, it's a totally legitimate start, I guess, to like sit, stay in the cities and sit there for weeks and days and months in the game and come out like a you know killing machine. But that's not my intention. Um, I want to make it a little harder on myself. I do, I do admit I have seventy four characters now. I think I recruited one more, um, and we have a, all the people that came off of this ship that dropped uh, in the in the one bay. Everyone's still alive uh, so far. Um, maybe I jinxed myself saying that, but. Uh, Trying to figure out how to survive in this thing on the Project Genesis has been a little little annoying, but not not too bad. I also went to their uh, Discord, and I've been talking to Snug Snug, who told me about this house. But I'll, I think maybe either I have a newer version or something broken, because on his picture he showed me these spiky things weren't here. This house was like this, but this place was purchasable. I can't purchase this place. This place is is private. Um, I can't get in there. I would love to own this building. I wouldn't mind paying like, you know, a shit ton of money for it and fixing it. But instead I got this one. I repaired it with, uh, f I think it was four or five, um, building tool, um, um, supplies. And then I built a little bit of this. I'm still one shy. As you can tell, I got two, well, two shy. I got to buy some more. Um, I didn't want to build anything off stream. Or stream recording, but I did do everything I could to show you guys everything. I did one day of gameplay off stream um, where I all I did was run around. Food? What? What's this? Who are you? Food. Now's our chance. Run them through. Uh, okay. So apparently I'm going to get attacked in a few minutes. They're malnourished. And they're going to attack my people, which I, do, I ran and put some food on some of these people, but it looks like all the food's over. Um, love to talk to them. There's literally no food on any of my people, and they're all getting pretty hungry. Down here, yeah, they're getting hungry too. Did I do this right? Like These people shouldn't have these, bon these, these problem bonuses. Let me see something here. Yeah, you got that. I bought some supplies offline, but nothing major. I just spent most of my money and then get, got it back by selling all the iron. And I got these four people ready to go on a little trip. We're going to have a little trip here quick. Uh, a lot of you Kenji veterans probably know exactly where they're going to go. Um, everyone else is just mining what they can. I found out that there's uh, two spots here, which I think is full. Yeah, so while well, I'm sitting here, we're talking to you guys for a minute. I'm going to grab some of this stuff up so they can keep mining without having to have people go with backpacks to these other places. If someone attacks me, you just drop the ore on the ground and you run back in town if you have to. Uh, it's not the end of the world. Let's see, it's only copper nodes that seem to do this. Other nodes seem to go up to like uh, 30, 40, 50 for iron. So I have no idea why some are, are stopped and others aren't. Um, that's just lady. She's getting pretty buff right now. That's Josie. Let's see what her stats are. Her strength's up to 10. Her labor brings up the 36. Um, her athletics is higher. I don't know if athletics gets trained. 
Uh, lots of running at full speed without encumbrance from a heavy inventory. Without encumbrance. Okay, so we have to run around naked, basically. So whatever. Let's have her do this. I'll let her mine again. Okay, so she's fine. These guys are... I, I did a little bit of this kind of stuff. I didn't do anything major. I just want to show some people. I did find some other nodes. I looked around like I said I was going to, and I did find some nodes that have been sitting around uh, unattended uh, around the outside of town. They're not big, but they're enough that I could I probably get enough miners. There's one that one person that could work that, two people could work that, one person could work that. This is all north of Squin. Or I guess this is north. It's outside of this entrance over this way. Uh, and I'm not finding a ton more, but I didn't expect to. I didn't expect to find ginormous amounts of ore. There's one iron resource. It's not really worth it because people attack the hell out of you. Um, I think that's pretty much it. There might be one back here, but I really doubt it. I actually found one all the way up here. But the guys who are working it are gone. So I have no idea where they are at. I think it's drunk. Oh, I know why. Yeah, okay. So we got some people running around. So I'm just going to grab these people up. They're on passive and hold. And bring them back here. So once they come back in here, the, the, the bandits will get attacked, killed, whatever. Who cares? But it should leave me alone. Okay, so they're doing that. Now, I did the one bad thing that happened off stream that you guys might not see. Um, I got attacked. What's this going on? Operating machine? Stop. Okay, one minute. Bag check. Sure. You can bag check me. Show me gear. Acceptable. Go. Who's in the crew? And the crew's getting attacked. You guys are getting attacked now, too? We're getting attacked from three different directions at once? With who? I didn't see anyone. Is there someone coming I can't see? Well, the crew's not going to attack. It's passengers. Gustav. Yeah. They're just being attacked by people we're running from, right? It says Blue Monkey's in attack, but I don't see anyone attacking Blue Monkey. Um, oh, I see. I, almost, I think I should just take this fight. But if I take the... Yeah, we need to get tough. Screw it. Um, how many people are here? Oh, let's take, we'll take it to the front and then we'll do it. So all these people... All right, is anyone here holding too much stuff before I do this? Um, you've got some food. Doesn't matter. There's some teeth. Some sandals. You've got some food. Baladek. Slazer. Stinks. Freeze. Yeah, there's no one here holding ore. That's what I was looking for. I don't want to have, have them have a pile of ore. So I'm going to bring all these people. I want to make a new squad, to be honest, of just these folks, but I'm not sure how it would work. I guess I could do it here quick. Maybe that might be a good idea, because if not, this node is, this is not worth it. 120% efficiency, iron quality 100. Hmm. It just means how quickly the ore comes out of it. Um, maybe we should do that. We'll call it like the far, the far node, I guess. I mean, I could. I don't know, man. I'm gonna bring them back here. Everyone here is selected. I want to bring them right here for now. Now, why? Why don't I just take the fight? Because if not, I have to repair everyone. I'm gonna take it a little bit, but I'm not gonna take it where they can, um, you know, beat the hell out of me and break me. So we're gonna go this way for now. And we're going to see what happens. And we'll see what happens with the other crew as well. Who should be running pretty well. See Andreas and Drunzi and Zenus. They're all running up there to the other place to get the mining done. These are guys are running in. The bandits are chasing them. What? Dust boss. You're going to screw with Josie. Sure. You hold the fuck you tell me? Okay. They left her alone. Okay, she's left alone. What they did, from what I can tell, I've got attacked by three different directions at once. They attacked Josie over here. They had to, they would have attacked these guys too. Um, this crew got attacked by another group, and there's another group out front. So this is what happens when you load the game in sometimes. So whatever. Look how fast Blue Monkey runs. Jesus. Go Blue Monkey. All right, let's see what these people are doing. I get, the one thing about all this that kind of sucks these guys are all getting attacked from different directions. What are you getting attacked by? Really? Oh my god. 
Run, run, run. Why, why are you so slow? Oh my god. Why did they get beaten up? I didn't see this happening. Okay, you assholes. You're hurt. See, this is what I was worried about. Like, they attacked me, there was nothing there, and they beat the hell out of me. So we're gonna bring these people over here and kick the shit out of this one guy, because I think they were on passive. Here, you guys go. Everyone beat the hell out of him. One guy, because I wasn't ready. Literally, what's going on? Piece of shit. I hate bandits. I love what I love to do to make up for this kind sometimes. I'll go beat up a, a dust bandit patrol or a, a hungry bandit patrol, and I'll take them to the fog and I'll dump them all unconscious or right next to a fog patrol. They all get gathered up and they go freeing them up because I'm so tired of this crap. It's like sometimes in the morning, yeah, I can understand. They want to beat me when I'm like really weak. Other times, like you can't possibly win. Don't even try. Put that over there, passengers. Are you in combat? Yeah, you're in combat with one person. So this guy should get beaten pretty hard by my people. Most of my guys do have weapons up here, so we should be okay. Andreas can't do anything, so he's gonna walk forward. He doesn't have a weapon, I don't think. Now let's see, is anyone else fighting? Uh, looks like the answer is no. Looks like the bandits got their ass mostly kicked. Committing crime. I, well, all I care about right now is the Dust Bandit boss. If I could, or Hungry Bandit boss. Is there a Hungry Bandit boss or is it Dust Dust Bandit? Anyway. Either way, let's go back to the most exciting thing. The thing about this that I really love. Yeah, here's the guys. Armed citizen. Citizen. I think there's a bandit in here. Oh, it's this shit. Okay. I know we're getting a little beaten, but whatever. That's what happens when you have this many people. There's no way to perfectly do it. I think she or he is down. Good. Andreas, loot this person, please. Take that. Take your cats. Take the armor. Take the weapon. Take your pants. You don't get nothing. Now, where's this person here? I can't see her. Andreas, pick her up. I think she's unconscious. Put down. First aid. I don't have a repair kit. Does anyone have a repair kit out here? Uh-oh. No one has a repair kit, huh? Please stop. What about Drax up here? He has pff, copper. Great. Okay. So we're going to have to bring her back. How bad is she? Unconscious and pretty bad. All right. Pick her up again and run back into base. Thank you, Andres, for the save. Get her back. I'll turn off your job for a minute. Andres, come over here, please. Why is everyone running forward? This is the one thing that really sucks. Like, all these people get into combat for no damn reason. And I'm like, hey, could you knock it off? Like, no, no, we're all going to run. And I, I have them on passive, too, and they shouldn't be doing this. We'll see. Some of them are going to run out and do some jobs. What are they doing? Operating machine. All right, while you're here, let's get some food for these people. Dizzy's hungry. Mark's hungry. Crew, are you fighting? While well, you're all fighting. Really? Oh, wow. They ran into the city and engaged me. Ha! That's stupid. What are you? Hunter Guardian. Hungry Bandit. I'm afraid we're going to get nuked by the friggin' guards, but maybe I'm wrong. We are starting to take these fights pretty good. Plasma, get that guy. Loot. Got caught stealing. Don't care. Loot him. Take that. Take the weapon. Take the shoes. Arrange it. Can I take your armor? Nope. Yes, I can. Take your pants. Screw you. That way, when they get killed, screw them. One thing about this game that's going to be really crazy, um, you're going to hit a point 
if you guys play this or if I play it or whoever plays it, um, you're going to get run over by the amount of stuff going on. And you got to be willing to let your people die or get beaten. Um, these people are hungry bandits. They shouldn't matter too much. That's a hunter guardian. That's a hunter guardian. That's a committed crime. Like, I don't think these bandits are even worth it half the time. We're just beating up a few people so we can get some, some stats up. See, there's like two people left. I'm worried the hunter guardian is going to do like a freaking attack and nuke all of us. Look how we're all beating his, beating his ass up. There we go. Okay. Some people are going to run out. Raziel's coming over. Unless you squirm, the cricket will be over. All right. Okay, so let's move all these people here for a minute. I don't think anyone's too hurt, are they? Not really. I'll turn off jobs with this group for one minute. Let's see if everyone heals up. Oh, wait. Jobs. Well, they're healed up anyway. Just go out there. Stop. God damn it. Let's see the other parts. Fine. Let's get our crew together. Captain Ban, you go here. Phaos, you got hit. You go here. And of course he has to get splinted. Son of a bitch. Of course, the one person I didn't want to get hurt got hurt. God damn it. Lazy, what about you? Yeah, everyone's hurt. Damn it. Oh, my God. Phaos is one of my people who runs around. Oh, what now? What now? Andreas is hurt? What's the matter? What are you? Citizen. Yeah, Mechla's fine. Anyone else getting attacked? Nope. All right, we'll just let these people go for a minute. I know we're going to have some problems, but that's all right. So Andreas is going to bring her over. I'm going to have to have Feo stay here. I was going to bring him over. He was going to be one of my people to do some good stuff, but I guess not anymore. Glitterbrand, get up here. Now that you guys are, back, are here and watching, I'm going to start working on some of these damn uh, projects. And I'm hoping with a resource bench, some other stuff, we can really get this place pumping. Uh, I need to get the friggin' fire, uh, fire, yeah, with the stuff going enough that I can actually work on this. Added materials. I turned engineering off on everyone. So I have to click it to make it work. So that'll work on some people and not others. Andreas is going to come up here. Create a dust witch. Yep. Glitterbrat should be able to take care of Mechla here. Put down. Andreas, what do you have on you? Nothing. Good. Go to your job. Do you have this? She splint kits on you. That doesn't really. That'll help. That'll help. Um, what's his face? Feos. So I guess what I could do is trade. Why me the stowaway? What are you doing? Oh, you got the med kit. Uh, by the way, one people, one person did get killed. A slaver got killed by my crew. Um, he t went, he ran all the way into the town after someone. I had to kill him, and here's his armor. I didn't want to sell it, uh, but I wanted to like show it off there for a minute. And I'm gonna probably get rid of it. He had an iron club, that kind of stuff. Andreas is filling this guy up. Come on, Barnaby the stowaway. Building research bench done. No good. Now you open this. Put these in here. Okay, now we got a research bench. Um, Right-click to learn tech. Oh. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Sorry. Three, three, boop, 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 boop. Okay, that should be it. Show research. Now, I'm going to have some people up here. Like, um, I think it's Tamaris is his name, this dude. He's going to be our researcher. All right, his job is to literally do this. He's going to research, show research, uh, slave buildings, <clears throat> small shack, general store box, general storage boxes. Why are these called slave buildings? Core, hive technology, small more house, gear storage. Gear storage? Wow. Okay, gear storage. Item storage. Food store. Okay, turn off gear store. Go on item store. Uh, prison, public sales, graffiti, <laughs> no. Hive technology, crafting, fabric, metal fencing, makeshift walls, electrics, gas lanterns, fuel generation theory, wind generation theory, let's see, indoor lighting, farming. Oh, thank God. 
I need to find something's wrong with one of my mods. I think I can only make um, campfire animal craft beds compared to camping beds, and I don't know why. And I want to find out what's going on. Cooking, sure. Campfire cooking, sure. Baking, sure. Industry, building materials, manual stone processor. This will help with with everything. Get that up there. Iron plates. Improved stone mining, sure. Storage boxes, ore, yes. Storage boxes, yes. Storage boxes, farming, yes. Forestry? Forest? Oh, that's one of the mods. Okay, slavery, core, hive technology, small more, more houses, simple dwellings. This is, I think, part of the uh, original stuff. Medium tent, pitched earth tents. Yeah, I think that's part of a lot of it. Graffiti, public sales, shop counter. I don't know if that's part of the Project Genesis mod or not. My lord, there's so many things. Your storage. Okay, I think that'll be enough defense. Makeshift walls. Let's get that up too as soon as we can. Because this person's going to bust it all out in one day. That's done. Well, well and we're going to buy some more uh, things when we're out there. The um, simple training dummies, lockpick training. Yeah, we'll do that for now. So Tamara should do that. And he'll get up here. He's going to walk as fast as he can. He's pretty slow. And he'll do all the researching. That's all he's supposed to do. Let's go back out here. How bad is Phaos' leg? Um, his speed is now minus 12. He was 20. God dang it. And our, our people are mining over there. So let's bring this whole crew. Let's see. Project, where's Ban? Ban is right there. She'll go over there. Lazy will go over there. Tarleron will go over there. We're going to move Tarleron into another squad, actually. Can we go to squad? Here's how you do squad stuff in case you care. Tall to run. We'll go from here up to here. Phaos will be moved down for now to right there. Uh, Phaos is hurt really bad, and I don't want to have to bring him up hobbling. So I'm going to send him back to... I'm going to have him get some food along the way. So we'll have him go here. All those bodies are gone. Now, I don't think any of these people... Sunshine, Chroma... Actually, Chrome, well, we're going to have Phaos trade with a lot of these people quick. Go with Plasma. Trade with him. We're going to take all the junk off him and sell it. There's some garbage. Or there's some stuff we can bring back. I think that's stick. Does anyone here not have a weapon? If you look, you can pretty much see. I think Midnight Designer doesn't. Yeah, he doesn't. Trade with Chroma. Nope. Trade with Phaos. Where's Phaos? Right in front of you. This stuff's important to do. I hate to say it, but it is. It's really important to keep all your guys um, getting what they need and making sure they have weapons. Because that's one of my biggest problems right now is not having weapons for everyone. Like some of them do, some of them don't. Does Archangel have one? He doesn't. Slazer? Slazer does. And yes, I know I'm kind of taking some time to do this stuff, but I'm, more of a, I'm very much a completionist kind of character. When I try to do some things, I try to get stuff done as soon as possible. And not have my people get their ass completely kicked. Um, okay. There's some meat on Chroma. That doesn't matter. Fiery Pit. You're good. You got that, though. Uh, trade with Phaos. I'm giving all this stuff over because Phaos is going to walk through town and hopefully get most of this junk off him. He's had some stuff on him for a while. The teeth are... They're funny enough, these people are eating the teeth. Like it says right here, who can eat them? Um... Hive Praetorian South Hive, Hive Ripper Drone, Hive Praetorian, Dead Hive Worker, Dead Hive Soldier, Dead Hive Praetorian, Dead... All these people are Hive, 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 of which he is. So him and Top Cat, not Top Cat, where's the other one? Uh, Dark Angel and Kasing are actually eating teeth to keep their hunger going. I'm not sure why they're doing it, but they'll eat them and I'm okay with it because we got teeth. How we got them, I don't even remember anymore. Top Cat, Freeze, he doesn't do that, he doesn't do that. Phaos, Baladek, Valtom. Valtom's a robot, right? Yeah. Okay, so all these people here will go take this entire crew minus Phaos. So Phaos goes back and gets some food along the way. You go here for right now. I'm going to send him actually to right there. Thank God this game is possible because, my God, it would not work. See how he's limping? Yeah. And all these people, including Freeze, I'm going to send back up here. I'm not sure Midnight Designer should be there, but whatever. Up to this crew. Because they're all mining. There you go. Put them back in mining. 
What I should have done before all this stupid crap went down was take my crew up immediately to where they were supposed to be. I'm trying to go to the way station. So let's go look at the other people for one second. Because if not, I'm going to get bogged down and never do it. So Silky Paws, are you mining still? Yeah, you're mining. I'm not sure where you're mining. Mark. And see what I mean? 17 in that one. 18 in that one. Here to buy flat skin. I'm here to trade. Sell this armor, which is worth nothing. And these are worth two, so they're not more selling. So arrange that. Take the meat. Um, yeah. What's this? Trader's backpack. Right click to learn tech. Right click. Oh, I think we own these already. I'm not going to try to do them again. Uh, Faos do everything we can right now. To get him. He has to go back to Glitterbrat and get the splint kit. So have him go over here. Trade for one second. Pause it. What's happening? Is there anything in here we need? I've been selling a lot of junk off screen. Uh, I got all the oil, all the ore brought out of all the mines for, <laughs> to this guy. It's still only 46. And I'm like, aw. <laughs> aw. <laughs> Instead of going all the way over there, I'm going to have him get a splint kit here and work on himself. So he'll do that. See how that's good. Wait, that's it? What are you doing? Where are you going? Split your injuries. Where are you going? He's medicking? Oh, he's got the medic skill. All right, so we'll bring him over here. I think he's going to come work on this chick. Maybe she's hurt. Yeah, and she's hungry. Barnaby the stowaway. Tamaris is work researching. Glitterbrad is doing literally nothing. She's got no food. All right, let's build some of these storage things if, if I can. Andreas, let's go back to operating. Your jobs are on. Barnaby's not doing anything. I guess I'm going to sell this crap off. I'm not going to give myself a bunch of armor that I think is OP, so I'll just bring him over here. The research is... Con I'm not sure. Is Tamaris good at this stuff? Sciencing, right? I think it's research. Science, one. So the science will go higher. As, yeah, it's, it's, you can see it training down there as we do it. It's going up as we talk. So over time, they'll be better. Let's go here for a minute. You guys go here. Construction. Buildings. Buildings. Camping. See, I can't... This is camp bed. It's made out of two animal skins. But I have nothing else for kit maker. A makeshift kit maker station used to make tent kit for survival tents. This is the tents mod. I know that. Farming? No. Lights? No. Mining? No. More buildings? Still no. Ruins? No. Planning table? Small research. So I can't really build anything right now until I get that, that science done. Show research. So, general storage boxes. Storage boxes, or I need to get all the way down there. All right, so that's fine. So I'll have Phaos do whatever Phaos is doing. Let's grab these people and go on our little venture. Hopefully, we won't get attacked too much. I could go grab some ore on my way and get more money. I'm not sure that might be a good idea or not. I'll go grab some of the expensive stuff like the copper. What are you? 100 guardians. I don't care about you. I wasn't going to do this originally, but oh well. I could bring another character or have another character that's sitting there become a hauler character until I can get those. As soon as those ore boxes get up, all these people that are doing all this stuff, they start hauling back automatically when the thing gets full. It might take them some time to get good at it, but that's okay. Something's wrong here. Why are you running so slow? 13 minus 7. Why? Oh, she's got stuff on her. What about you? You got nothing? Lazy? You've got nothing. God dang it. I might as well do a quick little ore run. Okay, Ben's not going to do it. Tar, you will. Take all that. Trade with Josie. Give me all this. See, I paid the cat so Josie didn't get demolished. I try not to have my people get completely owned in the face. I'll go over here and grab from these people. See, with all the food I gave them, they should be okay. Like, I got some food here. They're, they're doing pretty good for food. Why? Some of the other people are starving like crazy, and that's the problem. But yeah, they've got good stuff. How much is in here? 22. Ow. It's going to take some time. I don't want to really do that. I need another hauler character. You know what? It's time. 
Let's bring Vamp and Blue Monkey. Go to Squad Selection. Blue Monkey. I want to keep the robots close by, so the, these two cyborg peop robot people will do it. And we'll do Battle Deck too. And three robots. So you, you, and you. Come here and get me some help. Go to the backpack store. Thank you. I'm watching other people. I'm hoping. I, I know there's a lot of ore mining going on, and I what I usually do is catch up off stream for a minute. Um, let's see. Lazy. Grab some of this. Oh, that's gonna be dead. that's gonna be bad. <laughs> Lazy, no. Give some of this to, to Ben. Actually, Ben's do it this way. It's not trading it around. What's the point? Fourteen on her. Trade. Take off some of his. 18 on her. That's, all right, let's try it. Those other guys are running. God, I hate that. This is why I hate having too many things going on at once. I mean, early on in the game, when you have no research, you have nothing going on. What's going on there? You're getting attacked? What the hell? Oh, they're beating a prisoner or something, I guess. Nope. What? What are you being attacked by? We'll go here a minute. Let the, let the guards deal with it. I mean, I could go for them, but the dust boss is the only one that man, man Oh, there's a dust bandit. Do you have an actual sword? Yeah, you do. Oh, my God. Lag. It's time to save the game, I guess. The, the, these guys beat the shit out of these people, which I find is hilarious. That's the dust boss unconscious. So we're going to have Baladek sneak over quick. And loot him. I'll let the other guys fight the other guy for a minute. Steal your cats. I don't care. Attack target. Okay, now loot him. Loot. Take, take. See what I mean? Being, uh, being, um, what do you call it? Um... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know the terminology. Opportunistic. Have fun with that. Take your cats. I can't take your armor. Shit. I want your stuff. Vamps down. Of course he is. We hit the chest. Blue monkey, do me a favor. Come up here and grab from this guy. Actually, bow deck, pick him up. There we go. They can't take him if he's on my shoulder. The dust bandit had food on him. Oh, okay. Take the armor. Take the sword. The pants are garbage. Let's also take them. Take the head covering. I can't believe we're doing this. I mean, like, I'll take free shit, right? You know? Wait, no, no, no. no look, 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 look. <laughs> Don't worry. That's going to matter. Will it matter? Not really. Anyone out here we can steal from? No, no. Getting beaten. No, okay, that's good. So band of them are coming back, and we get some free money. Thanks. Now, we got this guy on top. Do you have anything? I know I got hurt, but loot the bandit. Take the chopper. Hey, a free armor I'll take it all day long. Right? Not really, Ben. And battle deck. Put him down. There's one. You can take him. Bye. Where's Vamp? Vamp, come here. What are you doing? Okay, you three, come in here. You get a backpack. First Vamp, come here. Nope. Show me your guns. Pause. Medium backpack. 
medium backpack. I wish I knew the space size of these things. There's a large backpack. Put that on vamp. I know it's going to slow them down. That's okay. And take cost a lot of money. No blue. You got a medium. Nope, there's a large one. Okay, a lot of money. I know it. It's cost me some cash. And then medium on the other guy. And that'll be battle deck. You get the thieves backpack. $5,000. Ouch. Let's go for 1500 bucks. There we go. Backpacks. Why? You'll see in a minute. Come out here. These three are coming in. We're going to bring all, th all these people with me. Not just a few. Why do you keep running? Why does he keep running off? What's his thing? What? What is? Oh, it's the meat. It's the meat. He wants to go cook the meat. That's why. Why is Feos down? He, he decided that of his own accord, he's going to go rest somewhere and heal himself. And I have no idea why he did that. And I didn't pay for that, so my cats got taken. Thanks, man. Appreciate your help. Is that no problem, boss? Just going to sleep here a little bit, boss. <laughs> Having some fun, boss. <laughs> oh, I I'm so glad. Thank you. Recovery coma. <laughs> I need beds. Okay, so you three come here. Vamp Tiger Warrior is going to keep doing this until I give him someone. Um, I think just for sake of I don't want to have to run him back, and back around a lot. I'm going to have him sell this shit off. It's free meat. Who gives a crap here? Take my meat. Take this. Mm, stolen. It's worth some money. Whatever. Armor. 243. It's, it's still armor for my people, I guess. Some boots. I'll let it sit there. Now these three, come inside, please. I gotta hurry. We're about to, they're about to close their shops. I think they close at midnight. Show me what you got. Lazy cells. Okay. Charleron, all that. And then ban. See, they got thirty-two grand. I'm not sure. I think it's because I bought all those backpacks. Okay, that should do it. These three, along with these guys. Let's see, is Vamp anything left? You've got some armor. You've got some armor. You've got some armor. I think we could... Hmm, it's worth a thousand bucks. Is it good, though? Spiked armor. Blunt resistance 21, cut resistance 90 on the chest, I guess. Protects right arm, chest, stomach. Eh. Melee attack bonus plus four. Melee defense bonus minus five. Hmm. Hmm. Does anyone here have armor? Lazy could use some armor. Tar doesn't have a shirt. Armor, armor, armored. Yeah, let's get lazy. Let's put on lazy. Fuck, screw it. You know? It's not perfect, but never. it's never going to be. And they're picking up the bodies and stuff. Who has, who has that chest? You trade with lazy. Trade lazy's big, but he lazy's also like super boss. So that armor, that armor. No, I still don't have a shirt for lazy. We're not gonna give lazy that helmet because that. Well, two thirteen fifty, twenty four thirty nine sixty. Do we want to give lazy the spiked helmet? It's gonna change his look. The boots have his inventory. Cannot learn this yet. No idea why. Um. Sure. Arrange. Arrange. Well, let's, let's, let's look at Lazy for a I gotta see this. Lazy, you know, he's got the... Why is he hurt? His arms hurt? Is it really hurt? Okay, yeah, he's, he's healing up. Um, let's look here. I kind of like the other look on Lazy. I, 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 I <laughs> fits. What about Tar? Does Tar have anything? No, Tar has nothing. Here, give it to Tar. Here you go. Here, trade to him for now. That way we're not wasting it, at least, all right? Here, you take this helmet. Enjoy. Want to piss off all the OCD people? Go like that. <laughs> no! I can see it. Um, yeah. And Lazy's got some other weight. We'll give him this, too. 1922. That's a little better. A little more free. All right, we're going to take all these people. Forget all the ore, I guess. No, I'm not going to need that one. I only have $11,000. We'll take a battle deck. We'll take... Vamp, and we'll take Blue Monkey, and we're gonna send them out. Let's, who's gonna mine? Them? Let's see. Uh, we gotta not mine, but we gotta bring up the mining materials. We're gonna bring run to this bar over here and buy some more food. So we'll buy everyone out along the way. There you go. You go there. You, you, and you. Wait. You, not you. Go to the map. I gotta send them. Hopefully, 
to the way station. They're running all together. Top speed. We'll go to these people out here and see if there's any more food. Here, vamp. You're elected. Come here. You can something to trade. Um, ration packs too expensive. I gotta, I gotta cheat this, keep this kind of cheap. Um, meat's good. I don't know why they uh, turn off jobs. Perfect. That's what's going on. Everyone wants the job. Here to buy. Yeah. What do you got? Food. Yep. Inside. Let's send these two guys out to here. I know they're gonna have to carry a lot. Vamps can do some purchasing. Vamp, you're a buyer right now. Thanks, man. Do the work. Why, the other three are running over. I should be watching them or whatever. Hopefully it won't be too bad. Eat some, get some meat. What's this? Check banners. You really want to sell me those banners, don't you? And I love how Feos is still sleeping on the bar. I don't know which bar he's on or what building he's on, but he's sleeping somewhere. I don't even know where this is. How did you even get there? I think he just found a bed. Because, yeah, this is someone's house. He just ran up there, slept, slept on it. Hydroponics. It's okay. It's free, apparently. Whatever. Uh, you know, give, give him some credit for, uh, you know, doing it. He's just sleeping over there. Research completes late billions. Thank God. Finish. Wait, you. Come here. All these people have to be bought from. Let's trade. Meat. What's this? Banner Designs, Trader's Backpack. I think I already own that. I like these sandals. They're very cheap. I'm going to buy all of them. For any new recruits, we're going to bring them back and store them. I know it's a little too much early on, but whatever. Familiar meat. What's that? Trader's Backpack. I already own it. Okay. Inside. I like buying all this stuff along the way. I mean, this is the one bad thing about it, but it's also kind of nice that the towns can support it. And we're going to attack. By who? Arg, you again. Who are you, and why do I care? Oh, you're a bowman? What the hell's going on? Dying, hungry bandit leader. Okay. They're beating the hell out of him. He's an archer. You guys just do that. Oh, they're dying. He's dying. Their, their leader's dying. How did the leader get out here? All right, fiery pit. Loot him for one. I want to see something. I don't know how you got that back. Rip them off. That that multiple hit stuff really sucks. Should I never mess with my bandits? Um, yeah, okay. These got bows. Hey, where's uh, Top Cat? Or Vamp? Hey, Vamp. You're in a bar. Why that fight's going on? Let's do something totally unimportant. Give me all the meat. Give me all that. Um, I try not to buy these. I'd rather try to buy these. For You get 125 nutrition versus 50 nutrition. 1,000 versus 600. I mean, why wouldn't you? But I don't want to spend that kind of money on it right now. So I'm going to bring it back. So you come over here. Vamp. And you go right in here. Let's go back to the crew. and see how this fight's going. They should have beaten them by now. Or mostly down. Yeah, there he is. Uh, stinks. Now, Boseman. Loot him. Oh, yeah. Boseman's going to be coming. A bar an arrow, man. Take the cats. Armor. Boots. Armor piece. Head covering. You take all their stuff. They can't do much. There was another bandit over here, but there's one there. I'm not sure how this all went down. He's almost done. His stomach's almost ripped out. Look at Dark Angel kick his ass. Dark's are kicking him in the shin. Stun Sunshine lands the blow. There it is. Loot. Wow. You know what? Dark Angel, you're becoming a archer as well. No, you're not. Well, you are for the moment. How about that? Sound good? I think so. Those are crossbow bolts and toothpicks. Bolts, regulars. I don't know why. That can't even fit in there, I don't think. All the stuff down? Wait, there's someone still in Flick? Okay. 
I don't know why Midnight Designers over here. He should be operating Copper Resource, but I think I know it's broken. I'm gonna put everyone right here. That should do it. Okay, now they're fixed up. Let's see how these guys are doing. They should be on their way. Yeah, they're gonna run by some stuff. I don't really want them to. What's this? What are you? You are Shek Hunters. Anyone I can talk to? No. Yes, I can. Shek Hunter Leader. They might sell something that might kill me. I have no idea, dude. That's where I'm going, I think, is the way station. Mechanical shop? Yeah, I think that's... Yeah, that's the, tr that's the way station. The way station's really good. It lets me get a little bit of um, materials to run these people. What's Vamp doing? Okay, Vamp's up here. Come here, Vamp. And you're going to trade... What, are you, what did you bring back? All this food. Trade with Glitterbrat for a minute. Trade, please. Trade. 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 Oh, Jesus. Arrange. Arrange. Ooh. Um, yeah, that's not good. Hmm. We are not running efficiently. I know someone's going to say, oh, my God, Ben, but you're, you're, you're not doing anything right. I know I'm not. I don't have the option. I don't have any storage yet. Uh, I can do it with backpacks, but I'm, try I'm trying not to. Um, yeah, that's not good. Glitterbat's kind of full. Oh, we'll trade on Samaris. He's not going to move for a while. You can hold some stuff. That's good. Yeah. Okay, now with Glitter Brat, maybe I can, if I can build something, if I could build anything, it would help a ton. Buildings, shelter, camping, kit maker. Can I build this inside? I think I have to build it outside, unfortunately. I can't do it out here. It needs to be green. Simple fishing, yeah, okay. Farming, lights, torch post. Kind of snapped the walls, I guess. That's weird. Oh, I can build one out there. Um, I don't think I need one. Mounted indoor torch. Large torch post. Okay, build one right in the center of the room. Let's do that. Confirm. She's building it. That'll get one of her building materials out, because you, you get them back, I believe, when you're done. Okay, now crew. Abandon them. They're running right past the hunters. I kind of want to talk to them just to see what's going on. Lazykin. Hi there, Wonder. Any luck hunting? Nothing. Fortress Fair is not. Bye. Damn it. What's in here? No one there? Okay. No, I'm not going to mine it. God damn it. So what I want to do is get these guys right there. Vamp is sitting there. Blue monkey in them. Okay, we got to move all this ore. Damn it. We're on the border. I love we're on the border of different towns. There's a town over there? <gasps> I didn't know there was a town over there. Has it always been there? Oh, my God. All right. Um, That's full. Drunzi, what do you got? Some of that. Drax, you have some ore. Drunzi, you pick it up. Boop. They'll start mining immediately. Now, good. And down here. All the nodes have to reload? No, they don't. Is that chick still on the ground here? Recovery coma. Zenus, let me guess. There's no ore, right? Boop. That should bring Andreas back out. So Morthis, his right leg is messed up pretty hardcore. Wolf Dragoon, yeah, come here, you. We gotta bring food to these people. You're looted. Pick up. What do you do with bandits? The one, the only thing you can do with bandits. Throw them in the goddamn road. Okay, you two come over here. We're going to take out some of this big stuff. Yeah, I thought so. Ballad deck at all that. Blue monkey, get over here. I'm going to send them back home. I'm not sure it's going to work. We're going to try. Actually, we might be able to sell right here. A, can you tell there's a lot of ore in this, guys? Yeah, a little bit. Jesus. You run home, too. Okay. Very yet? Yes, we're there. Perfect. Now, this little way station 
is like the hotness. This place lets you do everything you need when you're building up from squint. You buy stuff here. I mean, it's not perfect, but it's damn. Ooh, what's this? You're a drifter? Wait a minute. Come here. Okay, man, talk to him. Sorry if I'm getting quiet. I don't think I'm getting quiet, but we'll see. I want to help you. You don't know if it's because I think you need it or because I think you're a skilled warrior. Either way, do you want me? Perhaps. That's not going to be then? Hmm. For Carl's sakes, man, I'm offering my sword free of charge. Okay, okay. You can come down. Oh! Another guy? Wait, your posture sucks. Let's fix it. Whoop, whoop. Now you're fine the way you are. Um, idle stance? That's better. Toughness, attack, strength. Fine, good enough. We're going to call you... What are we going to call you? We need someone that's not here. Someone is going to be... I'll call him Dreyfus. Why? Because he's my puppy in real life. Dreyfus. He's got really bad skills and everything else, but he's good at toughness, attack, and strength. I can see that. Wait, wait, wait. Took you long enough for class in? Is that Arb? That's a tech hunter, man. Oh. I was trying to talk to him because I thought he was a traitor. Huh. <laughs> okay. So anyway, this place lets you buy a bunch of shit, and that's why I came here. Bring all these people in. Hold the harpoon guns. See, this thing out here, that's a different one, a tech hunter. It's like their parties all split up. <coughs> Excuse me. And uh, ooh, this, look at all these little, this is why I love this mod. Look at all these little uh, encampments and stuff all over the place. It makes the world seem a lot more alive. And also the sky is beautiful. I can't wait for Kenshi too. Cannot wait for it. Take a look around. Don't mind if I do. For building materials? Yes, sir. Ronan? And this is why we're here. I'm not sure if this is the one my mod's doing it or if the Jet Project Genesis mod is doing this. I paused it to show you. I have a mod. I forget what it's called. I think it's like traders have more money and more supplies because running around waiting days on end just to gather supplies, um, it's, it can be – some people think it's OP. Some people think it's, a, it's just a convenience factor. I'm a part of the later camp. I'm not trying to um, make the game easier – in any way, but I do believe that if I have like 100 to 200 to 100 characters sitting around and I'm having to have them sit in a place literally just waiting for respawn, it doesn't lend itself to really good gameplay. I'm hoping to get my this faction up and running as soon as possible without cheating. And one way I can do it is mining in Squin or mining areas with a lot of minerals. If I knew an area with like 20 nodes, I would go set up a base there right now, even if there was no food nearby. I, if someone could tell me where that is, I would go do it right now as long as it's not like full of beak things and like laser beams from the sky and stuff. So instead, I'm going to come here and I want to buy some materials. Now, not a lot, but just enough. I'm going to buy like one, two, three, four, five. I think I need about maybe 20. So I'm gonna buy, they're, not, they're not expensive. They only cost 100. So I'm going to get 10 on her. And the other stuff I need, um, hopefully, trade house, research blueprint. Small new building trade house. Structures like this were built by the earliest members of the Traders Guild, the ideal building to set up shop in. So you can set up actual um, trading in this game. I'm not sure if that's Project Genesis or another one, but I do have a lot of different um, mods on that add stuff in. I think this is part of it. It gets kind of crazy. But I can sit here and I can get all the crops I need. Like, well, we're going to go here on our way out to build whatever base we do. The whole group is going to sit here and we're going to grab a bunch of some materials. I'm hoping I can find a Garu or one of those bull bulls, put a backpack, or maybe two or three of them actually, fill them up with supplies and then go out and drop it down. Now I'm going to research some of it. I think I have to research it. So I'm going to grab one, two, three, four, five, six. I know it's a little early for that stuff. I don't really mind. Um, we are spending a lot of money. So what else do we need? We need these plates. 159. I'm going to buy like four on her. One, two, three, four. Her encumbrance is 48 out of 36. Not too bad. Let's see if I can get it up a little higher. Maybe 10. She's up to 54. That's pretty good. Let's go to the tower run. And we're going to build with him. 10 more. Okay. <laughs> One extra. Uh, we'll buy some plates. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now, I have it on yesterday's. Uh, I know I'm one of those gamers who has, like, a notebook by his computer. Um, I couldn't do, like, I have different mods and stuff to, um, not mods, um, 
monitors I could run and, you know, alt tab out. But every time I alt tab out with Kenshi, it really doesn't like it. Even full screened or window borderless, it really hates it. I think most games do. 24 iron plates, 8 to 15 billet materials. So I got to make sure I come back with at least 30 iron plates. I think, I, let's see, what does Ban have? Ban has 10. We'll put 10, 10 on Tar. <laughs> She's got 10. We'll put 10 on Lazy. Now, Lazy's at 22. 1, 2, 3, 4. Ah, shit. He's at 30. My well, money's going low. Okay, range. It puts 8 on him. I could put the sandwich up there. I could put... That's fine. Um, I do want some research books. I guess this is okay. We don't really need all this extra stuff. Let's go to band for a minute. We're going to buy some books because she's got, oh, she's a little slower. Let's, what's this new guy? Dreyfus. He's got a nice sword, much nicer sword than I have. Armor, shirt. Yeah, he's, he's doing okay. Fist protection 70%, attack damage effect 105. Really? Martial art bindings. I get you. So I can buy, the, I wish I could buy this, I can't afford it yet, but the books are cheap. So we're gonna buy as many of these as possible. Actually, let me see if there's a different price. No, there's not. Price markup, 82%. Mm. Let's buy it on ban. One, two. I just think I'm just gonna max myself out with books. Cause I'll get more money in a minute. Yep, that's all I can get. I could leave them here. I only have nine books. It's not the end to do, not the end of the world to do so. Or I could sell off some things I'm probably not going to use. Like the Drifter's boots are nice. Do I need them though? Mm, not sure. Not sure. Got these boots too. How much they cost? Two eighty-two. Plated short boots stolen from Dust Boss. Eh. Whatever. Crappy armor. I mean, kind of looking at that armor, going a thousand bucks, and it's, it's shit spiking. Yeah, fuck, screw it. Slow him down. <laughs> but, man, you just got that. Who cares? We'll get more, right? Throw it to the garbage, right? And we'll get better over time. This, I know it's high grade. I will be getting better over time. So, yeah. It's going to be for temporarily lose some stuff to get better stuff later on. At least that's my hope. So that just made us 2000 bucks. Buy as many as we can, up to 16. We're missing just enough for one. Let's see if any of those people got back. We're gonna leave these folks here. Let's see what Vamp. Vamp's over here at the, at the house. People are eating out of his pack. No, they're not. Trade with Griller Brent. Uh, arrange. And put this in her backpack. And she's cooking, I think. Think is the operative word. Give the vamp that. Give the vamp that. Put this down here. Put this over here. Splint kit down here. Sandwich, I guess, is okay. Stop. Glitter. I. Arrange. Now, she should be cooking this stuff. I think is the operative word. I don't actually 100% know. He's got the one thing. That's fine. We got some light in here now. We got a little cooking thing. I do want the cooking barrels. Tamaris is doing good work. I wonder if you can have two people on at once. I've never actually tried that. Topcat's wife is also a researcher. Let's see if she can get up here and also help us out. We'll just put her up here and see what happens. Worst comes to worst, she sits there. But if not, we have extra people to do stuff with. I love how Feos is still out there and still um, resting. I never paid for that, and I have no, I guess he just found a free bed, I have no idea. Well, Mika's finally back in the action, good job for you, nice job, I didn't even push her back out. By the way, if anyone cares, um, let me take one second for this. Uh, I really wanna say I appreciate all the people, like the majority of these people's names that are on both crews are either my mods on Twitch or my Patreons on Patreon. And I want the reason I did this series. I've had Patreon and before that game was for about three years now. And I want to reward these people who have supported me on Twitch for so dang long. And yeah, I'm getting a, YouTube, a small YouTube commu community going. There are people from you that are coming over from YouTube saying hi and joining the channel, joining our Discord and everything else. And I really appreciate that. Um, 
I wa should have done, become a YouTuber first and then a streamer. It would have been a much easier transition back like seven years ago when I f started doing stuff on YouTube. Um, but I made a mistake. I went and became a streamer because I thought it was easier uh, compared to video editing. I was very short-sighted on doing Twitch first. I don't have any problem with Twitch. I love Twitch. It's where I make my home. I'm a partner over there. But I really sh didn't know the order of operations on how to become a streamer and make like quote unquote content and all that kind of stuff. Um, I was a contractor before this. I, I never expected to be good into video editing and gaming um, presentation and stuff. I never expected any of that stuff to happen. So it's a nice, it's a nice thing, but I, I didn't really know what was going on. So I appreciate a lot of you that are uh, here becoming part of it. If you want to have the links down below for the Patreon, that's all cool too. But that's not the intention of this stuff to bring people in. It's just to reward the people that have been around for a long time. We've been a community on Twitch for almost five years and uh, a lot of you are part of it. I really thank you for it. So thanks a lot. Let's keep going. Let's see. Where's Blue Monkey? Vamp? He's up here. I'm going to bring Vamp. If they can both work at the same time. No, they can't. It's a small research. I wonder if I need a I wonder if I build a second research bench if that would work. I mean, I have to probably shotgun it across, but that's okay. What do you got? You've got nothing. So I'm just going to go here a minute. Drop this and drop this. And then I'm going to use him probably sell this armor too. Barnaby the stowaway is over. What do you got? Oh, you got that armor. Are you open? You are. I want to get rid of this stuff. And then I can bring the other crew back. I'm going to sell probably all of his armor. Ninja rags. 740. 31. 16. 206 for an iron club. That's stolen. 45. Samurai boots. Slave traders. Okay, we'll get rid of all this crap. Yes. And I can also change people's appearance in there. So, bye, bye. Bye. It's 206. I'll get better later on. Ninja rags. Samurai cloth boots. Slave traders got that one. It's only $31. You can keep it. This one's 745. I kind of like, I don't know, man. I don't know. I've been selling some stuff up here, too, as you can tell. There's some items and armor. Let's bring them back for now. You go over here. Barnaby's are really good. I want to rename someone into Bar Barnaby into someone else. I'm just not sure I can take away this slave thing, if he's going to leave my faction or not. I have no idea. So I'm just going to put him over here for now and not worry about it too much. Now, where is Vamp? You're down here. All right, Vamp. Those two are coming this way. You gotta bring. He's got to bring some food. Go back, go back up here a minute. We're going to grab some food from Glitter Brat and bring it out to that crew outside. They're all starving. They really are. Trade. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Hopefully that's enough. I want to see one thing before I leave. Glitter Brat, press I. We can learn that. Traders wooden backpack. We can make them now. I'm not sure how we make them, but we can make them. Why doesn't she, like... All right, whatever. I'm not sure why that happens that way, but whatever. All right, we'll go out here. Now, I got to go up to the farthest people first. Some of these people are literally starving to death. Andreas working? He is. He got iron on him? No. The Zenus? Yes, he does. Why wow, they're mining slow. Morthus, Wolf's Dragoon... Mika, let's get everyone on this side all together. Morthus is hurt pretty bad still. It's recovering, but it's taking forever. Okay, where's... Um... Let's go to Ban for a minute. Talk to you. Show what you got. Let's get all this and come back so we can start researching as soon as possible. I'm going to build a second bench. So I'm going to bring... Let's see, she's got 62. Tara's got that. Let's build a couple more on Tara. You can't afford that. <laughs> Good job. Okay, let's see how fast we move. Pretty fast. 15. These these Garo that keeps coming in, I really want to find out who belongs to them. Lazy is 23. Dreyfus is 15. Tralderon's 22. Ban is 15. Okay. These are the slow ones. So we're going to run up this Tech Hunter thing. For now. 
Complete item, item storage. Oh, thank God. Can I help you up here yet? You are. Oh, thank God. He's healing someone. Oh, you're still holding that person. Oh, geez. Here, trade with Vamp. Trade. Here, get some food. Take two food. Take three food. Eat some dried meat. We gotta throw this person over here. I forgot to throw this person over. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. It doesn't have to be perfect, so. I'm throwing him on the path because hopefully, like, a slaver will come by and just pick him up, but whatever. Because this person tried to kill me, so screw you, Pippi. Corpse day. Put down. Uh, auto save. Don't kill my game. Please. Oh my god, it's an hour already. I am so sorry. I get into this game way too much. Go for a ride. Woo! And, um... What are you doing? Why? What are you doing? Medic? For what? It's a hungry bandit. No. I don't want you doing that on him. Screw her. She tried to kill me. Okay. That works out. Ring wolf up here. Okay. I'm sorry I went over time. Um, as a lot of you probably can figure out, I'm having a tremendous amount of fun with this series. And I want to, um, you know, who is that? Who is that? Oh, that's what I want, Bone Dog. Check Hunter Leader. I think the Hunter's left, actually. Yeah, they left. There's a bed here. I can't take them apart, though. Sitting box. Campfire. Whatever. Out of resource. So I'm just going to set, set this now. Uh, go over here and run. Anyway, I really have a lot of fun with this series. Um, I think a lot of you know I'm really enjoying myself. Uh, I quickly lose track of time, and I'm getting sidetracked in a lot of the things I'm trying to do. I'm doing only a little bit of resource moving off map or off stream. Uh, basically, what I'm doing is I go to all the people that have uh, all these little mining nodes. I bring food up to them. I take all the minerals off of them off of their node, I bring everything to the traders that are in the middle of town, and I get rid of it. And I spend like one or two days. That's why we're on day eight, and I think I'm going to start this video, we're on day six, and I skipped one day. I don't do any combat. I don't do any exploration. I don't do any building. I don't really do any research or anything. All of this stuff, I might look at some of the traders and see what they have, but I don't buy anything to research or, you know, those blueprints until I can show you on stream. That way it's not as... Um, Hey, what the, how do you get that? Oh, how do you get the, this blade? How do you get this blueprint? No, no, all of it is there. And I showed you the one guy, the slaver that got killed. So hopefully that works out. I'm trying to keep this place or this playthrough very much. Everyone's doing the same thing. Um, no, sorry, I, I wrote, I messaged that wrong. I, um, not that, sorry, let's scratch all that. I'm trying to make this playthrough where you see everything. You see how to set up your own faction. You see how to do it yourself. And you see that, yes, it's a little mine frantic at points and i'm very much losing track of what i'm doing but it's not bad to give it a shot so these people are close enough um i'm actually going to go over here to the border zone go all the way to my town and what, did they just kill someone yeah, there's some blood there i think they did so i'm just going to take them and put them right up to the base these three people that are selected put them right up here like this and i'm going to build a second research bench and we're going to see what happens. We'll see, see what Glitterbrat's doing. For one second, she's the last thing we're going to do. Why? Because she's cooking. She's getting the food. I think she's doing it, but one, once we get the, the item storages, which I think I have now. Storage. Food barrel. This will make life so much better. A general storage for all food items. Characters can now come here to get food when they need it. 18 size, 16.8. Yep, that's what we're going to do. That is something I've been trying to get since moment one. So I'll put it right over here. All I gotta do is kind of rotate it with, uh, the, whatchamacallit, keys. Put that there. Confirm it. I think she had to grab this. And I think that might be it. Maybe it's a couple, but we'll see. Let's see here quick. She is! Oh, thank God! And then she'll automatically put these things between the two uh, with her cooking. And all we have to do now is buy meat or bring meat in. Oh, that's great. Oh, that's good. 
I know it's not the most exciting stuff to a lot of you guys. To me, it's like freaking amazing because I wanted to get this faction up and running as soon as possible, and we're doing that. And I thank you for being part of it. You guys know what to do with the buttons down below. I don't have to tell you. But thank you for being here. I know I rambled a lot. We went way over time, six, 70 minutes almost. I hope you have a wonderful day. Uh, there will also be a, a video out on Monday because I'm going to do the one after this one right after the stream today. And if you want to see me on Twitch, I am uh, one of the few streamers who streams literally seven days a week, 365 days a year. I'm going for a goal of 2,222 days in a row. It is my – I'm on day 1716 today, maybe 1717. And um, – if you want to say hi, you're more than encouraged to. Have a wonderful day. Thank you very much for your help, and have a wonderful night. See you in video, video 8.